Hello, this is John Payne from the St. Andrew York, looking at this Navara Adventurer on a 57 plane. Let me show you around there. A uh, little bit of damage here to sort out on the front wing. Um, light scratches as well on the front wing. We've got 5 mil on the tyre and uh, the alloy is in need of a uh, refurb. It's alright, the glass is alright and uh, the general condition is uh, light scratches on the bodywork and it needs a thorough machine polish. Uh, got some wear and tear on the actual uh, running boards as well and same here on the door, light scratches. Okay, that need machine polishing, same here as well and uh, a dulling of the paintwork here and uh, that needs sorting out. Um, it's got the, I think this is an optional cab on the back to be fair. I think it, it, it I think it doesn't come with that and uh, but on the back tyre we've only got one mil on there and uh, that alloy uh, that's all right to be fair just needs a good clean uh, on the back of the car here uh, that lens is all right uh, as you can see down here we've got a dent there and uh, on here the plastic snapped off uh, revealing uh, the chrome underneath and uh, obviously we've got some wear and tear on that bumper corner here as well and uh, on here as well showing some rust on the chrome that lens is all right let me double check that one yeah it's okay and uh dulling of the paintwork on the uh, tailgate let's just have a look inside one second um in need of uh, a good uh, steam clean as you can see inside as well uh, we've got some damage there, there, and there, there's some holes, and there, okay. Glass is alright, that's okay, let's just have a look on the roof. Yeah, we've got some uh, signs of uh, uh, little, uh, rust bubbles on the roof, etc. And a little bit of paint peeling off, and uh, a few scratches, and this sort of thing. So you get a general idea of the condition. Um, the uh, rear wing again, much the same as the other side. And uh, again, we've got uh, two mil on that tire to be fair. So it looks like it needs a couple of tires. Um, this as well, paint's coming away there and there. And uh, the alloy that needs refurbing, machine polishing and tidying up there. Same again on the doors, on that door as well. Uh, sills as well, they've got scratches on them. Like down here for example, and the front wing is uh, the same. It uh, needs machine polishing. Um, we've got, uh, what, three mil on that tire, and the alloy needs refurbing again. Uh, it's going around the front as well, dull there and well, that's meant to be like that to be fair and uh, we've got scratches some chips to sort out on the front bumper and around here and we've seen that before uh, that lens is all right that's okay that's okay that's all right yep uh, the uh, bonnet's chippy and we've got scratches here uh, okay and chips are touching and uh, windscreen, ah, let's have a look at that other side. We've got some paint coming away. There you go, let's have a look at that. Right, so you're aware of that, and it's just a bit further along as well. Okay, as I said, windscreens. That's all right, that's fine. Let's have a look inside. Um, yeah, it just needs a, a damn good clean. There's wear and tear on the seats, but it's not ripped or anything like that. Uh, I've got uh, two keys for the car. And uh, let's just get in and just see how many miles she's done. Now bear in mind it's done 123,181 miles. Uh, there's no dramas on the dashboard, no warning lights or anything of like that. The engine's running fine. I've driven it for a short distance, gearbox is okay, etc. And it feels it feels a solid thing. Uh, it's, just, it's just done a little bit of work, this car, to be fair. Um, I've got a logbook for the car showing them it's only had uh, two owners and it's on a 57 plate. 
and uh, it was registered on the 13th of 11, 2007. It's a Navara Adventurer DC uh, DCI. All right, there you go. Okay. Uh, the MOT expires. Check that out. January 2nd, 2015. So you've got a while to go on that. Um, let's have a look at this. Um, it's uh, last service was done on the 21st of the 12th, uh, 2013, 112,231 miles. So that was the last one, and we're up to 123,181. Um, there's that service before, so that's one, two, three, four, five services in the book. Okay. And before that, let's have a look. No, there's nothing before that. Right. So that's where we stand on servicing. Okay, but looking round in here, it's just a case of a very uh, good valet required. Uh, there you go, you've got your manual box, uh, heated seats. There you go. You've got navigation as well. Discs in there, there'll be a picture on. There you go. Show you what it's got. There you go. Right, uh, some wear and tear on the steering wheel here as well. And there, uh, as you can see, electric windows, electric mirrors, and sunroof as well. So that should work. Yeah, that's fine. I'll do it all the old way. And uh, there you go, that closes across. Let's just have a look in the back, see what it's like. There you go, that's all right, that's fine, no problem at all, just needs a good clean. As you can see it back at seats as well, it's not as if they are ripped to shreds or anything like that, it's, uh, it is uh, cleanable, no problem at all. But, you know, I've got to be honest when I describe these cars and tell you what they're like, but believe you me, this will make somebody a very, very good workhorse. Thank you very much.